Jason Bruges, founder of Jason Bruges Studio. Well known for site-specific commissioned art, largely for the built environment using a high-tech palette. The pandemic has been a reset in terms of creating site-specific work because you have no access to the site. You're relying on remote observation and also third parties to do that work for you. Constant Gardeners was an idea and a commission for the Arts Council Tokyo and it was a visual metaphor for highlights from the Olympic Games. So you might see a rower or a runner and we extract movement from that and these industrial robots generate marks in the dry landscape, this Zen garden. If you're creating something in the other side of the world, you really want to visit the site, you want to talk to the people you're collaborating with, you want to meet your commissioner with the Constant Gardeners. We have no access to the site and we'll have no face-to-face -face meetings. The idea was to fabricate, test, prototype at large scale. So we moved that from Tokyo to Yorkshire and we built the setup in a warehouse, one-to-one, -one, and then shipped the entire thing to Tokyo. We'd definitely been talking to suppliers in Japan in terms of the second-hand automotive industrial robotic arm, but there is a market outside London actually in the same sort of machinery, so we're able to source them and set everything up in the UK. Digital Filler Taxi is a spatial media artwork. It sits in the entrance of a brand new headquarters building designed by Foster and Partners and it's in the south of Seoul in a new techno park in Pangyo. We end up doing this tree canopy which you kind of travel through but also the Seoul weather patterns are actually animating and driving patterns through this canopy. We couldn't get to sight so we had security cameras an extra camera set up that would stream to us via Twitch so we better see the installation from a different angle. We use a series of Oculus headsets whilst we were on Zoom calls to actually look at the Unity model of the installation. It would be like a sculptor giving instructions to another sculptor at the other side of the room, perhaps behind a divide, and giving them instructions. Rotation Index builds a kind of theme, really, looking at how we use plants and horticulture within buildings and how plants thrive within the built environment and thinking about can we actually observe plants in real time. We were commissioned to create this work. There was a story told that was compelling and somehow that had managed to be translated across the video call but then we started work on developing a project without going to the site. There's opportunities that exist within the reset. There's a really kind of strong desire to be part of immersive, experiential, physical work, which is, is fantastic. I feel very confident that we can develop new designs, new ideas, and seek out new opportunities. So very much excited about the future.